starts raining. Today is such a gloomy day, but it doesn't stop me from planting in my garden. So over here, guys, this is where I'm going to, I picked a spot for my pineapples. I am going to plant it alongside this fence here. And I am going to, actually, first of all, I have some triple five natural organic fertilizer. I have azomite in here and I have some of that, um, darn, I forgot the name of that fertilizer I brought. I bought um, from the Garden Island Hydro, but anyway, it is organic. So what I'm gonna do is just sprinkle some of this first down. And then I got my goodies in here. And I am putting, it looks like a lot of fertilizer, but from what I understand, pineapples, they like a lot of um, compost and all sorts of good fertilizer. But this is all organic, so it doesn't matter. If it looks like a lot, it's actually, sorry, I am doing this with one hand, so I'm trying to, okay, and then guys, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take my shovel and I'm going to mix, kind of mix it in here, I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, I got my organic fertilizer and the goodies mixed in on the top part I just kind of loosened it up a little the soil it was already loose so I didn't have to do much here just kind of mix the fertilizer in and then I think I think just a few days ago I already showed me stripping the bottom leaves of the pineapple and all I'm gonna do is and it's good to strip it because it actually, this part can get a hold. I'm going to just put it in a, not a deep hole, I would say just kind of like a shallow hole or puka. And then the pineapple will start growing from the top. And then it's going to, um, well, hopefully it grows. Yeah, we'll see. Just because I live in paradise doesn't mean I can grow some good pineapples. But we'll see. Got to just give it a try. And it's perfect because... I can feel like the rain is going to come soon. I just feel it in the air, the change in the wind and everything. Let's kind of cover it like that. Oh, and I got one, two, three, four, five pineapples. And then I already have one growing that had a way head start so we'll see soon if that one produces a pineapple or not And one more, guys. A 
look I didn't I didn't use up all of my goodies here I mean there's still a lot in my bucket or container here and there's still more in the chicken coop but I wanted that's good that there's leftover because I wanted to use some for planting my okra I got so much planning to do today and I figure it's a perfect day because it's not hot and hopefully when I do have all my plants in the ground it'll have a big downpour and it rains so I don't have to water that's the plan anyway so here is my five pineapples so I am gonna actually you know what this darn chickens has been coming in my garden because chickens can fly <laughs> I don't know about pigs pigs you can see all the tracks the pigs make on the outside of the garden but this darn chickens been flying over coming in here and scratching up all my newly planted plants and it's pissing me off but anyway I hope I don't come back out later and find all of my pineapples out of this hole but anyway let's go and name it because Lara named her pineapples I figure why not name mine so the first one is gonna be because I have three children three cakeys my oldest right here Xavier my middle child is my daughter Aaliyah and Makana and here I'm gonna name it's gonna be me and my husband so Cheryl and Frank perfect a great pineapple family anyway thanks for watching have a great day guys aloha hey guys guess what the rain is right on schedule you're welcome pineapples